Hey there, today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Street Fighter 6 style frame viewer mod for Guilty Gear Strive. You can see it's pretty helpful for seeing frame advantage, other information like recovery and active frames, along with hitboxes. Uh, so let's just get into it. Before I do get fully started actually, I do want to say I'll credit everyone I'm aware of who made the mod in the current working version in the description. If I have missed anyone or any information, let me know and I'll fix it ASAP. So first off, what you're going to want to do is go to the GitHub link that I have in the description and download the standalone.zip folder. You don't need anything else for now. Then what you're going to want to do is open up Steam, right click Guilty Gear Drive, hover over Manage, click Browse Local Files, and then go to Red, Binaries, and open up the Win64 folder. So your Win64 folder might look a little bit different to mine right now, which is fine. Uh, but what you need to do is take the standalone.zip that you just downloaded, Put it into the Win64 folder, unzip it, get the standalone folder, go inside, and take everything out of that and put it into the Win64 folder. And just replace whatever files you might have to. Um, then you can just delete the standalone, which should be empty. So that should be all you need to do to install the mods. But just to make sure, I'm going to show you a screenshot of how your folder should look like currently. If you have installed mods before into the Win64 folder, or maybe you've just uh, deleted a file by accident, or you need to verify something, you need to make sure your folder looks exactly like this screenshot. So delete anything that seems wrong. If you're missing a file entirely, you should validate your game files on Steam. But assuming that your folder looks exactly like this, you should have the mod installed perfectly. And also, sorry, this is post-production. I forgot to mention, your mods folder should look like this. There shouldn't be anything else in it. Delete everything that is in the mods folder that isn't just these two files. And then when you boot up Strive, hopefully, your mod will be installed nice and clean. You press F1, it will remove the frame viewer, which is important if you're trying to record replays, uh, because the frame viewer does stay in replay mode. F2 will show the hitbox uh, viewer. F3 will pause the game. F4 will make it go frame by frame. And uh, it's generally just a pretty good mod. So hopefully this works out well for you. Any questions, feel free to put them in the description. I'll get back to everyone as uh, well as I can. And, uh, have a good day.